here and possibly come tour through U-Town. But tonight, right now, up from San Marcos, let's hand this over to our final performance for the night, Blue Moon, thank you. to your touch I'm an addict I'm addicted to your touch Simply magic and euphoric Overwhelming, can't ignore it I'm an addict I'm addicted to your touch What's the rush? There's no worry, there's no pressure. What's the rush? I'll admit I'm impatient too, but I'll wait as long as you do. There's no worry, there's no pressure. What's the rush? My heart beats like it's on a mission. I'm scared to be in this position. My skin right there Making me forget who I am and where What's my age, what's your name, how to stand Concentrate, fix your face Or I can be smiling so hard Giving you ideas, you can't play with my heart I'll be gonna roll if I want to But never naive, please I don't know the case of the rules All I wanna do is kick it with you Baby, roll a big cool Not get confused And pick it back for a moment or two
Hey, thank you all. Uh, we are Blue Moon from San Marcos. Uh, thanks for being here. Thanks to Safe House. This song is called Soul. Hey, thank you. <laughs> hey, if you're streaming this live, hey, what's up? A 
Thank you guys so much. Y'all are such a great audience. If you feel so inclined to rock side to side, go ahead and do it. It's dark. Nobody can see you, especially if you close your eyes.
Thank you. We've got two more for you. Hey, thank you guys so much. Shout out to Safe House again. Shout out to Boer and Hong Kong Wigs. We are Blue Moon, thank you. Bye. 
Friends of the internet, thanks again for hanging out with us tonight here. Safe House Session 121. That is it for us tonight. Blue Moon, thank you for closing out the show. 
Before we get too far into it, um, Lola Frosty 21, hello, hello. I really enjoyed them. Followed them on social media. How about that? Thank you, friends. Thank you. We got a troll. Look, we got trolls on here and we got trolls <laughs> over there. Uh, super impressive grooves. Thank you, Skip Esquire. Great set. Whoever's running this now is spot on. That's our boy Gator in the house. Um, Blue Moon, thank you all so much for coming out and performing with us tonight. Are you doing all right? Yeah, I'm doing great. That was a fun set. This cool. is a cool experience. Okay. So. Yeah, thank you all for having us very much. It was, uh, it was a blast. So. Good. Right on. Cool. The, before this goes off of the screen, favorite part of being a musician, we just get right in. This is the thing we do. Questions come from there. I read them. You answer them. Maybe. And uh, we go from there. Favorite part of being a musician. This, the, the, y'all, are y'all in school for music? Is this a? I just graduated with a performance degree on jazz studies for bass. So yeah, I just did that. Yeah. And the drummer is also a jazz studies major at Texas State as well. So that's how kind of we got connected. The the uh, the the you know seeing people like you play. I'm like. This person could probably play anything. <laughs> so, so I think that you know, I think that that's when you that's that's the whole studied, uh, you know, that it, it shows, you know. I so. appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, of course. Um, do you, uh, Lola Frosty Twenty One is asking, is there a favorite part to being a musician? Either of you, yeah. My favorite part. It's a weird is, question. Yeah, it's a, it's a nice question. <laughs> yeah. um, I guess it's really just the connecting with other people. You know, yeah. music is so powerful, like, and just the fact that everybody, you know, can agree on at least one song that they both like, you okay, know, and that's sure. really cool how it just yeah. brings people together. Right. You know, just all these, these people here, people yeah. streaming. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's funny. It's it's always something super unlikely. It's like, oh, yeah. It's like, yeah, this person that just did this, like, R&B set. They're really, like, a huge Iron Maiden fan, too. It's like, what? Get yeah, out of here. You like, never know. <laughs> <laughs> And and how did y'all meet y'all all four of you met in school then? Yeah, um, well I'm actually not in school. I just live out there in San Marcos. Okay. So yeah, I was connected with these guys about two years ago. Okay. And yeah. So the three of you have been kind of the core of this for the last three years. Yeah, uh, Isaac Somewhat. for like the last yeah. year and a half, two. Yeah. I don't. Yeah. Isaac joined us about a year and a half ago or so. Yeah, yeah. I joined about like two years ago, maybe like May 4th, 2017 was my first gig or something like that. And then, uh, yeah, just um, we've been playing with a lot of uh, a lot of people lately, so. Does it keep you pretty busy down there? Oh, yeah. And I mean, we all do things outside of music as well. Like, I play with other groups. I mean, we all have jobs and stuff, so this is just something like we're really trying to make happen out here. And, uh, you know. Every show helps, you know. The uh, Charkey. Hey, Charkey. Is there some new names? I think I was going to say, I think there's some friends of, uh, some friends, some people that know you. Cool. Does the Potato Man on your album cover have a name? I hope they do. Well, yes. It's like the moon, right? It's a, no, her name, it's a her. Her name is Eve. It's like Eve from Adam and Eve, but okay. she's just like a little prototype humanoid a spud yeah or a potato <laughs> <laughs> we've got to be uh you know you can't it's uh it's so i do you have some cds over there yeah we have merch yeah. and you're on Bandcamp, and and you can buy all of the uh the albums t-shirts everything online? yeah exactly Where, where's your brother watching from san marcus uh, denton texas denton yeah is is uh hey hey denton how you doing out there Cool. Shout out Chris Charkey, got his own Twitch name. Maybe watching some NBA Jam later on. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. So, how was? Um, do you come up to Austin for many shows? Yeah, lately we've been trying yeah. to get out here more. What's? Uh, I mean, Austin is growing into the surrounding cities, Kyle, San Marcos, to some extent, and it's like this is kind of where we were when we moved. From downtown, not like we had a choice, but like you know, uh, we're we're very happy with our new home here at Spokesman. But South Austin is people get venues get priced out of downtown, and we adapt, and now we're down here. So we're we're excited to be uh, you know, being able to have access to uh, artists like you. Down here. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, we're glad that like you know this is going on. They can't stop us all forever. So. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So. 
Do you, I, I, y'all mentioned that you're in school, so I think that, I imagine you're younger than me if you're in school, and the question, I guess, I, 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 do y'all do have Spotify accounts? Is that how you? I don't have Spotify at all. What's, what, what do you, how do you discover most? I watch YouTube, go on the internet, and uh, I just have to suck it up with the ads, but, but yeah, I don't know. I, I haven't had Spotify in like at least seven years since it came out or so. But. So I guess what I'm getting at is, <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, we got you. yeah, yeah, that's our Spotify. Yeah. <laughs> no, if the, uh, I guess what I'm getting at is you guys being, the two of you being younger musicians, have you considered what this looks like in 10 years, 15 years, as far as where your trajectory goes and where your sort of, I guess, your path as far as possibly doing this as a living and for a living, you know? Yeah, um, it's it's kind of cool. It's just like the more restrictive that avenues get for sharing your music, just the more creative you have to get. Yeah, yeah. And um, as long as you're willing to just keep trying new things and keep like, you know, thinking outside the box, then like you're you're fine. Okay. Okay. That's a, that's a great uh, that's a great attitude. <laughs> yeah. I mean, and, and this this I feel like a broken record because I talk about this. Cause what we are trying to do here is try to we're trying to bring an audience to independent musicians through Twitch through live stream, give people a young or give people a an opportunity to interact and. Really get, you know, you answer a question like, you know, how else are you going to find out about the potato man, yeah, woman, exactly. I guess, through interactivity. And, um, you know, it gives people a better understanding of who you are, more of a reason to invest in what you're doing and support what you're doing. And that's what we're trying to do with Safe House. So I guess what I'm getting at is a lot of the younger people that we host, I'm just wondering if they have certain expectations that a generation maybe before had going into the industry, hitting the road, doing the grind, doing that thing. Is that how you think that your um, peers are kind of working or the approach they're doing? I would just say you should come into it with no expectations and just like try to take each little step at a time, you know, and that's it. I mean, that's the only way you can get anywhere. I mean, it's not gonna happen quickly. But you just gotta like take the small steps over time. Yeah, I, I guess like a lot of younger people, it's kind of hard because you see a lot of other younger people like with all these successes and getting yeah. signed to this and doing that. Uh, but it's just like if you want to last and if you want to do music for your life, then you can do it your entire life, sure. you know. Yeah. And so yeah. it's kind of like, you know, as you said, just go into it knowing like what you want and right. just like accepting what comes. It's interesting to me because I think with the exception that we're dealing with is we're in Austin and it's getting really expensive here. It's not like you're streaming from, or we're, you're in a band and uh, uh, I don't know, somebody's going to be watching in like Missouri. I'm going to be like, Kansas City, you're like, man, fuck that guy. But yeah, no, uh, it's, not like you're watch, it's not like you're a band in um, Kansas City and it's <laughs> affordable there and you know, you can it's a little easier to balance a job where you don't have to go out and do the grind of like work and still have time to be a musician is that, is that something that's crossed y'all's mind or at all or? i feel like if austin is thriving if this area is thriving then we should also be making more money you know so what do you think yeah i agree i like i get that venues you know struggle in their own way but like revenue within the city itself is here and you just have to you know be creative and like how you're getting that right, especially if you're hanging your hat on the live music capital of the world it's like give back to the people that made the city yeah right. yeah for sure so, anyway that's it for that <laughs> what's Isaac. what's there yeah. Isaac. <laughs> do, you, uh, <laughs> do you guys have y'all have any plans uh summer are you doing the hot summer night shows are you gonna oh, come yeah, up to Austin? i want to check out some of those yeah. we just wanted yeah. to say hey yeah. to everyone else oh hey, oh, hey here they are yeah. Yeah. Cool. hey <laughs> How, how are we doing? Good. How are you? Great. Great. Is this your first show here? This is my first show here, and this is my first show with this band. Below. How do you think it went? I thought it went pretty well. <laughs> I hope they thought it went pretty well. <laughs> yeah, All right. Great. Cool, cool. You did great. You did great. Uh, I, thank you. I, uh, watching there. I, I was telling this comes up off, and I've, I've got like a Jerry Lee Lewis thing where I'm like, I want to retire and just play like house piano somewhere, oh, like yeah. an old bar. <laughs> Can you, you do piano lessons? Uh, I could, yeah. Yeah, hit me up. <laughs> okay, cool. 
And we were talking with you, you, you about uh, uh, the kind of mentioned him on bass is like you on drums like just watching you play a little bit yeah. and your style with the like studied drummer right yeah I, we go to school at texas state university and there's not much you can't play right sure yeah you could say that i guess yeah. i guess <laughs> is there i mean are there who are your who are your drummers um off the bat i love ronald bruner jr uh can't go wrong with elvin jones okay. um you know all the old school cats but of course, Border Ridge, Tony Williams. I mean, the list goes on. Okay, but, yeah. cool. <laughs> Very cool. Well, uh, here we go. Indiegogo.com Project Hollywood Grass Stairs, Grass Stains music video. What's what's this all about? Yeah, we're um, releasing a video next month that we've been working on for the last okay. few months, Great. and uh, we're trying to crowdsource it because okay. we put a lot of money into it. So we're just trying to get some of it back. Okay. Um, yeah. So thank you, Chris. Yeah. Chris. Yeah. Chris. Oh, right there. Yeah, for yeah, real. That's my yeah. brother, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Chris. Thanks, Lola Frosty. Thanks, Blue Moon. Y'all got anything else? Uh, no, thank you guys okay. again. Yeah, okay. thank you. We'll do it again sometime. That's yeah, all right. for sure. Okay. All right. Thank, you thank, th thank you all for coming out, coming up from uh, San Marcos. Yep. Appreciate you making the trip. I uh, sure 35 at like 9 o'clock is not that bad. Right? Nah, it's pretty good, unless you know. Cool. Uh, thanks again to Blue Moon. Thanks again to Booher. Thanks again to Hong Kong Wigs, and thanks again to everybody out there, our crew here tonight, Dave, Lindsay, Casey, Jim, all of our friends here tonight who stopped in South Austin on a spokesman. Thanks, spokesman, real ale. Uh, check us out, Safe House ATX, safehouseaustin at gmail.com. Blue Moon on Instagram. Blue Moon TX. There you go. Cool. And uh, Blue Moon on Bandcamp. Yes. Yeah. All right, cool. That's it for us. Please uh, consider subscribing to the channel if you can't afford it so we can continue to improve our show here. And uh, thanks again. Follow the channel. Follow us on Instagram. Hit us up. Let's talk music. Let's talk live streaming. Let's do it. I'm Eric. I'm Eric with an E in the chat. Thank you for spending your Wednesday night with us. That's it for Safe House Session 121. We got Mama Duke next week with ATX Social Club, our monthly hip-hop showcase Tune in next Wednesday night, and we'll see you then.